Well, thanks for staying with us. A reminder of our top stories this hour. UK court orders PNID to make interim payment of £1.5 million to Nigeria. A gunman attack Abuja community as police rescue kidnap victim. Outside Nigeria, five killed in Colombia after violent protesters clashed with riot police. In sports tonight, Serena Williams threw to semi-finals of US Open with focus on the 24th Grand Slam. To other news, members of the Bayelsa State House of Assembly have now described as fake news claims that their speaker ran away with a miss. The 24 member State House of Assembly also passed a vote of confidence on the speaker. This is as they also screened and confirmed two more additional commissioner nominees. Joseph Kunde has more. We are not after what to take over government or whatever interest. At first, it was after the judgment of the Bayelsa Election Petition Tribunal ordering a fresh election in 90 days. That news filtered in the air about moves to unseat Governor Doye Diri. I want to move. I'm pleased to move that this house do pass a vote of confidence on Mr. Speaker. But now, to mark the end of plenary, before going on their annual recess, the 24 members of the House have passed a vote of confidence on the Speaker. The issue as to Mr. Speaker running away uh, with the maze of the House never happened. Indeed, the House is united. We are working with the Speaker. And the Speaker is the best thing that has happened to the Sister Assembly. Under him, we have passed several laws. Concerning the rumors you asked out there, there was no need at some point, as some people would want us to think and believe. But then, Nigerians used to say in every rumor, there is an iota of truth. But the House want to say, no, that's not correct. In this particular one, that very day, the House did not even sit. Also, the House screened and confirmed two additional commissioner nominees. You are free to approach my office. Um, I do not know the portfolio I will be that I will be assigned to me. But I can assure you that in my own little microcosm, I am ready to support the bigger picture of the prosperity agenda to see how we can actualize the objective of His Excellency, the Executive Governor of Bayelsa State. Unity of purpose seems to be the watchword members of the Bayelsa State Assembly are preaching as they rally behind their speaker, Joseph Kunde. TVC News, Yanagoa.